viewers, welcome to the Hovel. Uh, we saw that dramatic ending courtesy of Luke and Charlie last week. Oh, my heart still hadn't quite settled down from that. Oh, <laughs> running between the wickets at the end was, yeah, scary. Anyway, here we go. Still undefeated since Egham, and here we are playing top of the league. These guys, Cobham Mavorians. Um, uh, yeah, yeah. A very, very good team by the sounds of things. We had our game rained off against them at the beginning of the year, so we know nothing about them. Um, so yeah, we're all just it's all going to be to play for here. We've got our openers. Char uh, Regan is on the strike, and Dave on the non-strikers end. Ants back this week. Uh, still missing uh, Nathan. Uh, we've got a much more normal team this week. Um, uh, so yeah, we're, we're looking in good shape. We lost the toss, and we have been put into bat. So. Uh, yeah, we'll see where that goes. That, leave, that will leave Cobham in the driving seat in the second innings to try and knock the runs off. Or defend and block out for a draw, which is always challenging to do, trying to get someone out that does absolutely not want to get out. So we'll see how it goes. Um, first over, a bit of left arm over. There's a the first over. We're done? Oh no, maybe one more. Um, so yeah, we'll, uh, we'll look to go well. and. Uh, we have got a bit of rain, so we could have a bit of rain interrupt to play today. It's raining as we speak. Uh, well, raining, just very, very light. A couple of spits have just started, and uh, we are due an absolute downpour in about 20 minutes. Uh, maybe that could come a little bit soon, but we'll see how we go. Well, Regan's uh, made use of that full toss and put it to the boundary. And that will be another. Nice way to start, get through the first over. And that will be another one. Let's have a look at this umpire's uh, signal. This is great. Oh, a bit of a double sweep going on. Lovely stuff. Three consecutive fours there for Reed. We'll take that. Was that a flash of lightning? Hmm. Absolutely nowhere. Umpire unmoved. Regan's off again. He's making a liking to this bowler. Uh, yeah, that's me. He keeps, keeps going. Hey, is that one going to run away as well? Yeah, it sure is. He's been going along very nicely here. Bowler clearly struggling just to get on line. 16. Is that going to go 20 for the loss of no wickets? Yes, it is. There'll be another one. Regan is uh, batting beautifully here. What an exhibition we're seeing so far. Magnificent cut there from Dave. Whistling across the outfield. Dave joins the party. There we go. Dave reaching out of that one. Got a little edge. Well taken by the keeper. 29 for one. Or four. And the rain is coming. Oh, is Ant replacing Dave, goes for a big drive, snicks it past, slips, and he'll take a single. Well, Ant has left one that has clattered into off stump, and that is not what we wanted to see right now. That's a yeah, poor judgment from him. 34 for two, off five now. Very well run too there from the boys. Yeah. Wonderful back there, extra cover. Regan playing at the wide, slightly wider one. And um, yeah, well caught, well watched. It's the end of Regan. So we have just come off for rain. Um, we had a good hour, hour and a bit delay for rain actually. Quite a long delay. Uh, we are going to have 39 overs, uh, which we can back to and they are going to have 29 overs, 
uh, if we take all 39, otherwise obviously there's a bit of chopping and changing around to be done. So uh, yeah, the game is drastically shortened. Uh, if we're going to have to, if we're going to win and we back for the whole 39, we're going to have to bowl out top of the league in less than 29 overs, which sounds challenging. But we do have a great bowling attack, so fingers crossed we will do so. We've got to bat our way uh, through, get somewhere up there, get a good total on the board. 43 now off six, so uh, that's not a great place to find yourself in, but it's not horrific. Uh, conditions are going to change a lot as well. It's extremely humid now. Could be a bit more rain about also. So yeah, there's uh, going to be lots more twists and turns to the two today just yet. Um, replacing, uh, who came out? Ant. Replacing Ant, I think that's the last shot we saw. Replacing Ant is Barnett, he's at the non-striker's end. And Ben Davies is just coming out replacing Regan. Wide run there, Barnett's put his hands through it. Just got the toe on it. Run across the outfield for four. Oh, his pass slips hands. That's going to run away. Oh. Life. <laughs> ben clearly knew that I was going to the boundary, so he screams way till nonetheless. Whether you heard it on the mic, I don't know. It's going to go to 55, I think. It should be 51 for three at the moment. 55 for three, off nine. Third one that's run down there so far this over. I was just milking the singles down to uh, third man. I'll take that. Drop it that's in. glorious from Ben. Yeah, yeah good boys. Run them, run them. Now the outfield's got wet. It's certainly slowed up a little bit. Well, run three there. A lovely cut shot there from Barnet. Oh, and a misfield. They'll get a couple there. Great run in between the wickets these, from these two. Really, really good. Wow. We've got a great view of that one. What a beauty. The hand in me chair. We'll take that as four. Oh, we're straight up in the air. Straight up in the air. Easy catch, really. Well, that's, a, that's, uh, that's the end of Barnet. And uh, Luke Smith on his way out already to replace him. Uh, batting at number six for us this week. Oh, can't have been close from the edge. Holding well. Oh, it's on the floor, it's running in my direction. Nips over the right. There we go, it's great take by the keeper. He's had a couple of stonking catches behind the stumps. And uh, yeah, standing up, to, standing up at the stumps to all of their paces as well. Very, very handy pair of hands. It's the end of Ben. 19 he made today. Didn't make. Any more than that. That's a wonderful, wonderful stretch. And he got back into his crease. Some very, very well there indeed. He's having a great day. Always past the hand. Gano's got a life there. Wow. Okay. Okay, no. Straight back over his head. Is it plugged? Oh, I thought it almost plugged there and stopped, but it hasn't. It's made its way over the bit, over the rope. And it's off the mark. Okay, another one. <laughs> that is absolutely absurd how hard that was hit. That was practically 10 or 12 feet off the ground the whole way. Four more. 
I don't know why they're running. I wouldn't waste your legs. Well, the opener's come off from this end. Quite a spell from him. And uh, we've got a bit of spin into the attack. I'm going to change position in a second. I'm not going to move around behind the bowler just yet. Good start. There's also a change of bowling on from the far end. Luke Smith on strike. Score at the moment. 99 to 5. That's 21. Is that going to get stopped? No, not quite. That's a good shot from the Absolutely beautiful. Good chase. Got a couple. Shot on the scoreboard. And goes 106 for 5 of 22. Oh, beautiful from Luke. Running nicely. Second one. I don't think that's going to make the boundary though. No, it's not. But they're going to run three. Glorious. It's going down. He got to it. Very difficult chance. And I'd imagine that after Luke just uh, just caressing the ball across the outfield a few times, that ball's probably a bit like a bar of soap at the moment as well. It's not going to be easy to catch at the best of times. Has he got enough on it? Absolutely he has. And I very rarely doesn't have enough on it. Very powerful hitter of the ball. Oh, it's a misfield. Oh, he's kicked it further away. Has he kicked it for four? No, nearly. <laughs> that would have been great. Oh, that's been put down as well, an extra cover. Oh, just past the fingertips, but it's four runs and we'll take them all day long. Let's have a shot at the scoreboard. It's going to go to 128 for five of 26. Lord, look this. Stamp and send it. That is a monster hit. They are in fine form here. Oh, yeah. He's having a great day out there so far. Thoroughly enjoying himself. He's caught hold of that. Sorry, I thought, I thought he got straight to field. <laughs> Magnificent knock there from Gaina. Really, really well controlled. Very well managed. And utterly brutal at the same time. Got his foot back down to me. or look at things. Went the other way. Apologies, didn't go the other way. It's a completely different bowler. <laughs> I didn't quite hear that. Change of bowling. There we go. He went down the track at him. He missed it. He knew he was out straight away. And uh, that is it. That is the end of Luke. He's batting very nicely. Big Willie replacing Luke. Good play. Good delivery. Oh, it's the stamps of safety. Oh, who put them there? That's going. One bounce. Four. Kano's not going to miss out with that. He hasn't got enough of that. And it's gone down. It's going to get a couple. Big Willy goes over the top. Mid wicket. Four runs. And he has caught it. 
very, very well caught. Does get the ball turning, this bowler. It's a good bowler. 161 for seven now. Off to 31. Danger man has fallen. Gaino on 57. Guy coming to join Will at the crease next, I believe. That skipped off the surface. That did not stop at all as it hit the ground. Guy's off the mark. Change of bowling from the far end. I think it's the opener that will open from this end. Left arm over. Coming back on. Really clobbers him over mid wicket. Four more. Leggy still in action from this end. It's a good amount of turn. Not with a half track though. Oh my lord, that is awful. <laughs> Guy has managed to drag on a half tracker from miles outside off onto stumps. Oh dear. Guys, what oh guy? Who is going to swat those ones away? There'll be four more. Is he going to find the gap? He might well do. Quite how he's managed that, I'm not sure. He's gone over the field of extra cover and between the two guys on the boundary. Wonderful. That is, uh, that is regulation catching practice there, Adam has just given that, that cover. Oh, that's got to be approaching shot of the day so far from Charlie. It's gone for four. Magnificent. Ah, there we go. That is the end. Charlie having an almighty swipe and uh, getting edge onto the stumps. Well, that is that. So that is all. 189 for nine. No, sorry, not for nine. 189 all out for 37. So, I don't know how many we're overs we're going to get at them, but it will be... Maybe 30, I think, possibly. I'll confirm in a bit. But uh, they're gonna need 190 to win. Here we go, viewers. 189 to win for Cobham Mavorians. Oh, That's a magnificent start there from Willie. That was almost an antesque leave. <laughs> Oh dear, can't get over that. Apparently he was briefed. Bowler's not doing anything with it, it's going straight up and down. So he left the one that was going straight onto off the dump. What a wally. Anyway, 190 to win. Uh, big Willie opening up from the far end. Not sure who's going to open from this end, it might well be Charlie. But look who we've got in slips again. <laughs> Dartford Tunnel. Excellent. Guy from this end, maybe got an edge early doors. There we go, there's the first boundary in Cobham's pursuit. There's the edge. It's a wonderful bit of work. Well, that's how the last one came about. We set him up with. Similar delivery. He's going to nick him off. Hopefully. Oh, oh, it's in the air. It's over the top of all of the fielders. Almost landed with Barnett, to be fair. Oh, it's a sterling dive, but not quite long enough limbs on him to stop it. Guy's got another, two to his name. Absolutely clobbering middle and off that. Stumps and bales everywhere. Lovely stuff. Well, this is, uh, this is a bit of a similar start as Hawley had, to be fair. He lost a few quick wickets and uh, Cobham seemed to be doing much the same. So uh, at 16 for two, I'm gonna have someone come in and they're gonna hopefully look to consolidate.
Glorious shot. Kano's okay, gonna have to chase it down. Beautiful way to start. Nice shot. Oh, there's another. Tempted him into a big drive there. Big limbs on this bloke. Long ones. And a uh, loose one like that, and he's going to put his hands through. And it will go. Nice shot. Great stop by Barnett. Could be a run out. Wonderful work by him. Well, he's seen some serious fielding today. Very good off his legs. A very good bat from all around the ground, to be fair, from everything I've seen so far. Very nice. 34 for two off seven. Wow, that is beautiful. One bounce four. Very nicely played. Now let's see what guy's got to reply with. 38 for two off seven. They've got, uh, they've got 30 overs to chase this down. 190 from 30 overs. It's a fair task, uh, but not impossible. You don't want to keep losing wickets. They lost a couple of quick ones. And uh, yeah, I think this is a key wicket to get. And get it quickly, we must. Uh, good reply there from Guy. Let's see the next one come in. The fielder, it would have been catchable. It's in the gap. Uh, score 48 for two off nine at the moment. Ben Davies has been brought on for a bowl to replace Guy. That is short and wide. That is nicely cut. Pass backward point, and that is four more. 52 for two. With 10 overs on the board already, that leaves 20 remaining. And uh, Cobham need 136 to win. So doable. I doubt it's not doable. Yeah, big Willie and Ben bowling at the moment. They both need to break this partnership uh, and this is the wicket that we need. So uh, let's see how we go. There's a ledge and he's gone. Really, really good work. Ben gets the breakthrough. That's the one that we needed as well. Made a beautiful 26. Well, make that 55 for three now as the rain is just coming down a little bit, but it's only a very small cloud above us, so hopefully it won't cause us too much of a problem. Well, as the rain fell, uh, we had to come off very, very quickly there. Uh, very, very quickly, so, I mean, to be honest, the players didn't even make it off the field, but it was enough time that we have now lost, or Cobham have lost an over. So they are going to have to bat till 29 overs now. Uh, so I don't really know who's that done any favours for at all to be honest um, yeah we've got one over less to get them all out and there's already not many overs to do so uh, although we're not doing a bad job let's face it uh, and they've got one over less to try and score the run so well we'll see how it pans out in the end and if oh well dug out wonderful from them good bowling great pressure to put on a new batsman um, yeah so well we'll see we'll see how it all pans out here we go, new batsman on strike. Big Willie's going to want to join the party of the wicket takers. Oh, yes. Not going to join it just yet. There's another one. Magnificent. Where has this Charlie come from? Spectacular. The wicket taker Stevenson nearly didn't get the opportunity for an introduction because he was too quick. Well, Big Willie's come off from the far end and uh, yeah, that's seeing Adam into the attack. Usually we see him bowling from this end, uh, but not today, it seems. Beauty. Lovely shot. On it. 
on it in pursuit. Oh, couldn't quite get down to it. A little bit too much to do. Loose one there from Adam, got put away. Wow, he's latched onto that one very, very nicely. Let's try bowling a slightly shorter delivery. It's, uh, yeah, going over the scorer's head for six. Oh, short of scoreboard. Well, we're here. Oh, Adam, the wicket taker, Stevenson, leaves us wicketless. Uh, it's come off from the far end, and we've brought Gaynor on after a stonking spell from him last week, getting six for. Uh, yeah, we need more of that for today. So uh, if, he, uh, if he could duly deliver, that would be lovely. And, uh, and a brutal 50. So he's having a good couple of weeks of cricket. It's a good start. Didn't quite carry. Will didn't pick it up. He's not claimed it. Well, there you go. I could have struck nearly and far off it. All over the top of cover. Beautiful. Very nice shot. Oh, well dug out. Okay, no hitting those Yorkers again. That is absolutely enormous. Oh, it went very high, but I thought that was leaving the ground. It's not. It's just plonked over the boundary. Wow. Lovely striker of the ball, this ball, this batsman. Oh, no one there for the reply. Oh, we could have a two, could have a run out. But we have got a run out. Ben Davies deploying the overarm throw, which he doesn't often do. And uh, yeah, well taken, accurate throw. It needed to be accurate on the stumps and Ant was there. Run out, quality work. Really, really good from the boys. Uh, and that's a good player dismissed. Very, very good indeed. 35 he's got himself up to. There are the, the number threes on 36. I'll tell you what, let's have a look at the scoreboard. There we go, number five's just gone on 35. 108 for three, 108 for four, sorry, off 20. So uh, yeah, they've got nine overs to score the remaining 80 runs. Oh, hello. Oh, not out. Great arm from Guy. That's pretty close. Oh, I thought that looked seriously close. Jano gets one. The heavens sound like they're opening and I'm getting my umbrella out. Quick shot. Oh wow. Well viewers, I don't know how well this is going to come across. Probably terribly. However, I'm doing it freehand because I have started packing everything away. My tripod is one of those bags walking across the uh, walking across the field as we speak. Um, we've called it. The umpire's called it unfortunately. Uh, that is that is all we're going to see for today. That last rain shower was too hard and it went on for too long. There was not enough game time left to finish it out. So uh, apologies if, if this is really loud because uh, I'm quite close to the microphone. So uh, yeah, I would imagine that is going to be a winning draw, which is still not bad for us. Um, I just wish it wasn't a rain affected game, to be honest with you, because uh, yeah, well, we could have had a belting game. Oh well, as always next week. And uh, yeah, still a great result against a very good team. We'll take that. Thanks, viewers. See you next week. Bye-bye.